saying? Just rambling a little bit, just uh, talking about people. I want people to stop beating themselves up um, because you never know when there's an, a true enlightened person watching your videos. One thing I've noticed too is that you'll see people who were actually going through this, right? And then you'll see... You know, you'll see like a change. It'll be like they first start going through this and you, you'll be able to relate to them. You'll see the stress. You'll see the... You'll see or you'll hear the stress. Uh, you'll, you'll hear the pain. You'll hear the, the confusion. And one thing to look out for is when that gradually just seems to get better. When when they, when you know, watch out for people who automatically just want to say that, oh, they found the most high and they got peace and, you know what I mean, and things get better. Because you got to understand the most high said that we'd be in a fiery trial. And, um, you know, he never said that the world would ever love those who weren't of it. So he didn't say that they would hate you for some time or to have been written. You know, he said that if they hated you, know that they hate me first. So what what I've noticed is there's been people who've gone through this phenomenon and then it's like suddenly things have just gotten better for them. And then one thing that you can contribute with the target speaking on things getting better is symbolism. Watch how they play with their hair. Watch how they play with their facial. Now, I know that they can, you know, the whole... I don't look at the whole touching your eyes and nose. I, I'm way more deep than that. I won't give up my... Uh, if you want to know how I figure out... Watch my video I just posted. There's one of them that I'm going to post. Um, but if you really want to figure out how I'm aware to know who's fake and who's not, just hit me up. I'll tell you. Because I, I'm not going to give up my, uh, my goods. Because then people will try to then... Um, go around their methods and use different ones, and I don't want that. So, back to what I was saying. Um, with the, the the stalkers, you you know that they're fake because they'll talk about how it just stops and they prayed. You know, they may talk about fasting. They may talk about you know sin patterns uh, being ceased and how you know that's all they had to do, and the gang stalking went away. And I'm here to tell you that if the people who were around us were worried about sin they wouldn't be doing what they were doing <laughs> okay so this is this is you're not fight you this is not a sin battle with uh with these people which is more and so you can't see me pass if i turn around or not you won't be able to so he's putting on a blinker Either that's somebody behind him or around him, but we can wait. So the sin pattern, right? If this was about a sin pattern, ju just know we wouldn't be going through this right now. Because if you don't think that what we're going through is by created sin on the other half of the party, you're stupid. If you don't think these people out here, if you don't think the Most High considers this as a sin, you're stupid. You're stupid. A lot of people who are doing this will say they're patriotic, but... The word patriotic comes from where? Associated with what the term America is. We know America is, is, is just an uh, uh, offspring of Babylon, which is Rome. So patriotic to them means they're just playing their part, if you didn't understand what I was saying. So when you realize that, you know, people are talking about it's getting better and just stopped, watch out for these motherfuckers. And have these motherfuckers... It look like some crackheads, <laughs> you know, like they go one minute for talking about how you got to stay in the Bible and all this and how things just lightened up. You never and plus you never know what these alleged targets were dealing with. You got people, man, who were dealing with witchcraft or who deal in witchcraft who are targeted. Not everybody's targeted for the same reason as well. I keep telling people some, but people don't want to accept it. And it's probably because, you know, I'm talking about too. We're not all targeted for the same reason. You have people being targeted for judgment most of those people are so-called Edomites, so-called white people. You know what I mean? And then you have some people who are truly nationality of the most high that are white as well. So, like I said, it's not a, so much a race game, but it is. So that's how come it's, it's detailed. You can't just say 
every white person is, you know what I mean? You can say a majority of. But one thing people have to understand when you talk about this black and white, which black people don't talk about, so-called black people, is the two-thirds. The Bible talks about black people being done away with, just like he talks about the so-called white people being done away with. The Bible actually gives a specific amount <laughs> of how many so-called black people are going to face judgment and hell and damnation. Two-thirds. Two-thirds of... And black people are already a minority. So two-thirds of a minority race, or not race, or, if, or, or culture, if that's what you want to call, are going to be done away with because they choose to worship the Jay-Zs and the Diddies and they want to have demon time and only fan time. And I'm not judging anybody. I'm just telling you this is what these people involve themselves in, okay? And they don't do it as a means to get by, okay? It's not, it's not like you doing what you got to do to survive. You understand? These motherfuckers who work for the beast, they can get a job. They have no problems getting a job or getting employment unless they got, you know, I've seen, hell, I've seen felons get jobs around me. I can't even get a fucking job, but I got felons and sexual pedophiles. Anyway, neither here nor there. So, understanding the dynamic and the severity of the situation, you should be able to dissect and conclude that, okay, all right, this must be, you know what I mean? This must be this, this must be that, so on and so forth, right? And when you really realize that everyone around you has, you know, when they're saying they have nothing to lose, they've already lost everything. That's why they don't have anything to lose. I mean, they've already sold themselves as prostitutes to Satan. These guys are sluts for Satan. That's what that's what they are, SS. And I ain't talking about Impala. These niggas are sluts for Satan, right? They're sluts, whores, whores for Satan. And not only are they whores for Satan, you know, these are they're whore for men. So they're not only whores to the spiritual realm, which they call Buddhist or Kundalini or um, uh, or your uh, your chakras. <laughs> Niggas love talking about some damn chakras. <laughs> Niggas love talking about demons. That demon time and chakra time is the same damn shit. Anytime they can lock on an energy and say that this is your only, your energy cannot, like, stay, like sexual energy, right? They've demonized sexual energy to where it's a lower state. It is if you're lustful, but you can be lustful in your mind. So then how, if you're elevating in your mind, wouldn't your whole body elevate? If you look at the chakra, they have certain elements of elevation where everything else is stationary. There's only certain variables, and the only variable of the whole kundalini chakra is predicated on the person not on any experience on the individual the most high is predicated on him he doesn't care about the individual because the most high you can be uh, uh, filthy and the most high will clean you up the kundalini deals with you as an individual trying to better yourself which you'll never do especially not in this world with the food you eat being poison and tainted from the poison media, the poison news, the music, fucking air. It's a death trap. You know, you're, in a, you're in a walking death trap. The only thing is that the Most High is giving you things that you can look at as blessings, trees, birds, nature. That's, that's resemblance to the Most High. That's why he left it here. He put it here so that you could understand how great he was. No damn big bang. Make niggas from monkeys to humans. And these bitches with the way fat their ass. You ain't gonna tell me. I've never seen no monkey with no fat ass like the way they got out here. Let me tell you something. Just, <laughs> I ain't in the bestiality. Okay? Just, let's just be real. Okay? But I'm not seeing no... I Ain't no way these he jokes out here with these, these fat asses turn no damn monkey to no damn human with these fat asses I refuse but you niggas can believe it if you want to you want to believe we came from apes and we still got apes here not everybody evolved and what's the everybody talks about evolution how come the monkeys are still out here we should have a zoo, we should have zoos full of humans <laughs> they do you just don't know they exist you understand so where the, where how come we still got monkeys and apes how come they haven't evolved into humans yet they late? I mean, damn, how late can you be, motherfucker? It's been 2,000 years. They got the police. The police eat McDonald's? His bitch ass ain't eating no McDonald's. 
cop out, nigga. I hope you die from that shit. <laughs> hope you get hope you get indigestion from that shit, you fuck nigga. Nigga out here talking about eating McDonald's. That nigga eat no damn McDonald's. That nigga watching me on my dick. Hope you gotta take a shit, nigga. Look at this nigga. This weirdo right here, nigga. Weirdo. Fucking weirdo. Anyway, like I was telling you, son, these niggas ain't got shit to lose because they already sold it all. <laughs> what what else can you give, motherfucker? You didn't give your ass. You didn't give your mouth. Huh? He, oh, they, don't, oh, bro. If you don't think these niggas is out here fucking and sucking, bro, m m bro. Okay, go do your history on these black fraternities and sororities, bro. The white man wants you to defile yourself before he'll let you know anything. He still won't tell you about yourself, but he'll tell you something. He'll tell you about him. He won't tell you about who you are, but you gotta suck some dick first. You gotta get on your knees. Bro, if you don't believe that this shit is real, then I don't, I don't know. They don't like niggas as a whole anyway. I live in Baltimore. 90% nigga, if you didn't know. Okay? 90% African American. So, you're not telling me that we go from liking niggas, right? You're not going to tell me that we go from liking niggas to, uh, to from hating niggas, slaves, making them slaves, doing all this shit to, to, Multi-millionaires to billionaires? Nah, chief. These motherfuckers are none of the above. None of the above. Okay? None of the above. I want to see if these guys follow me. Let me show you something. I don't know who this is. <laughs> and who knows? But I like... Uh, anyway, like I was saying... You know, like I said, these motherfuckers always want to be into some extracurricular shit. And it's nothing. <laughs> mm. Let's see if this motherfucker was following me, son. Bah, bah, bah. Like I said, I got time, son. That's why when I come out here, I got time in the world, bro. I got all the time in the fucking world. You see how they try to change your life for me? Because they think I'm going across. Look at them, look at them, look at them. I just, now let's see who came down here. Oh, it probably was the feds. Because if if I, I wasn't gonna say anything, but I saw him like he was um he was definitely like trying to like work his way down this motherfucker. You know what I mean? He was definitely speeding. And if you saw he was just at the McDonald's, so we got him on recording. So if he tried to come around me with that fake shit, it would have been it would have been a dead. It would have been, you know what I mean? A L. It would have been already it would have been a L. would have been dead already. So we can play with these niggas, you know what I mean? Pause. Play around, joke around with these motherfuckers. I'm surprised, bro. He shine. Ooh, I think I may have gotten him. Ooh, I think I did. I think I got these niggas, bro. I think I did. I did. I did. I did, I did, I did. I did because um, I bust through that alley and nobody seen me. Yeah, I did. That's what's up. I mean, I be talking to myself like I'm proud of myself. Like I don't be doing this shit. Like I do be doing it. You know what I mean? Like I do be doing it. Because I do. I does it. I be doing it. But it's just, you know what I mean? These niggas are so retarded. You see how they got the lights on me? I'm just gonna sit in the parking lot though. I'm not gonna pull them to my house because I wanna. These motherfuckers suck, especially if they got. Let's see what they got over here, bro. I like to see what they had. Looks like they got a white car over here. Looks like they got a white car over here. Okay. I'm surprised they didn't have none of that. You see, they got this car right here, which just doesn't matter because they. I could be anybody. That's what I like about this shit. That's why I be doing this. That's why I don't. You know what I mean? Because I could literally be anybody. You shine. You know what I mean? But I gotta leave anyway. I gotta leave out again. That's why I like coming home and leaving back again because then they can't guess me. And if they do see me, it's like I don't care because. Ooh. What did you really see? 